Actually, come on, tick over a bit. There it goes. <coughs> YouTube's unconstitutional and borderlining high treason use of removing videos, channels, and whatnot, how it applies in conjunction with COPPA, which should never exist, content creators on YouTube such as myself and you, the viewer. One of the concerns I know of, without even having to ask, without even having to look it up, is YouTube would be saying, we don't want kids doing dangerous things they, that they see on our platform. That argument is flimsy. At its utmost best, it's just outright bullshit. But where that argument stands right now is at its worst. Which is an infringement on the freedom of speech and the expression of individuality. Quite simply because TV and movies display horridly violent acts consistently. And Coppa's not pitching a field day over that one now, are they? No, they are not. Now, here's a, a decent train of thought you can exercise. Parents, it is your responsibility, not mine. I'm not your babysitter. You don't pay me. As of currently, no one pays me. Parents, it is your responsibility to teach your children the basics of honor, discipline, respect, and self-control. YouTube, stay the fuck out of everyone's lives. Kappa, delete yourself. Kids, it is your responsibility to exercise self-control. I don't give a fuck how old you are. If you're old enough and you've got the drive to punch buttons on a keypad or controller or your phone and watch YouTube videos, you're old enough to learn about honor, discipline, respect, and self-control. And old enough to start exercising those things. It's your responsibility as a living being, as an individual, to exercise those things. Parents, it's your responsibility as a progenitor of an organic life to teach that life how to exercise those things and how to learn those things. YouTube. You're no one's fucking parent. You're not their fucking babysitter. Stop acting like it. Kappa, delete yourself. To all the other content creators, that's just the basics. We, the content creators, are our responsibility. within the boundaries of decency, within the boundaries of honor, discipline, respect, and self-control, <coughs> is, it's not as cut and dry as you think. There's, there's a few different categories it falls into, uh, comedy, education, entertainment, There's, there's several different categories that uh, 
I'm not going to bother listing everything, okay? It would be tedious. It would take too much time. Within the boundaries of common decency. Here's an example. Logan Paul should have never even uploaded a video showing a dead body. Not in the middle of a forest. There's a time and a place for showing a cadaver. And that said an autopsy table. And uh, with our current medical knowledge, most certainly not a human body. Maybe a frog, a pig, maybe something else. Like if, if you were going to dissect it for the biology aspect of it. But with a lot of uh, warnings up front and honesty and openness about it and working with a trained professional and a lot of other red tape, maybe a human body, but never just randomly Oops, I found a dead body. Let's make a video of it. Hell the fuck no. Absolutely not. You're not Hollywood. And Hollywood wouldn't even use a real dead body. They've got actors for that. That's their job, to act as a dead body. Not yours, YouTubers. There's a bunch of other stuff that I could go on and make lists of, but fuck that. That's the end of this video. Links for PayPal and Patreon and a couple of other support websites. They're there in the description. Like or dislike, support or don't. But I would prefer if you like or dislike and support. So, till next time, bye. Woo, look at that. Under 10 minutes.